Hey, happy Mortgage Monday. Today I thought I'd talk a little bit about why the lowest interest rate may not necessarily be the best interest rate for you. Um, so in order to obtain the lowest possible interest rate, um, you may be paying some additional upfront costs uh, in the form of origination fees or discount points. And it's important to not only look at the interest rate, but also what those fees are. Um, if you're paying a large portion of a discount point, uh, it's important to look at what is that amount being added to my closing costs? And then also how much am I saving on a monthly basis? And I think the important question here is what's that recoup period? How fast do I get that upfront money back? And if you're able to get a lower interest rate and get that money back, you know, in a, you know, 14 to 18 month window, that may make a whole lot of sense. Um, if you're planning on only being in the house for five years and you pay upfront at costs where you don't recoup the money for seven years, um, that may not have been the best use of your money at the time. So there's a lot more that goes into interest rates than just the interest rate itself. And it's important to be educated on those pieces. If you have questions about interest rates and upfront fees, um, feel free to reach out. Happy to give you uh, my thoughts uh, in your particular scenario. Have a great day.